welcome to modular classroom today we are going to see how to generate bulk certificates by using microsoft word mail merge option in combination with microsoft excel where you can type where you consist of the list of participants available for that the prerequisites are you need excel which consists of the participant list and the data of the event and you need microsoft word mail merge option so this is the outcome output of the particular certificate that you have designed see there, here i can able to see four certificates for example i have chosen only four where these four names like anu banu chandru pradeep these four names have been taken from this excel sheet which consists of four columns date name designation and email the date is here name is this and designation is this so to bring the output like this certificate with the help that is the participant list that is available in excel i am going to do click ms word i am clicking new and search for online templates i am just typing certificates and press enter you can choose uh, from the available templates consist of many templates we can choose any one of the template and you can customize by yourself that is you can apply the font you need the color you need the alignment you need whatever you can do you can customize from this available templates i am just clicking this certificate this certificate has my template click create it comes like this so here you have to customize by giving your college name by or your institution name or the event name the organizer's name etc etc so click down and you just customize Just choose the font, another font, minimize so that the college names appears in a single line. And here also you just minimize the certificate of appreciation. You can choose whatever the font you like, the font the color you can choose from here. And here you can write this is to certify that. Uh, you just uh, click the font uh, already i have a uh, design one i'm just copying from that Click on this and give the left alignment. Like this, you design. I'm choosing already what I've been designed, and I'm just pasting, pasting here. Uh, just see, since this is the table, you just uh,
Just be careful since there is a table. You need a That's it. Just ensure that it must not go to the second page. Only it must consist of single page. And here, uh, now this is what we have designed. Now we want to insert the particular Excel data into this Microsoft Word. So the option available is just go to mailings, click start mail merge, click step by step mail merge wizard. To your right, uh, the, it opens in a mail merge window. From that, select the document type as ledgers and click on next starting document. And it will ask you some questions like uh, what to set up. That is to use your current document or you have to start from a template or start from existing document. Like this where questions ask. We are going to design this current document only. So use a current document. Click next. Select recipients. Use this existing list and click on browse. Browse means you have to choose the particular Excel sheet where we have stored these participants name list so that choose the uh, location where that particular excel file is available click on open it will ask to select the table there is only one sheet it can excel file contains and click ok these are the names that are available click ok now choose insert merge field see you can see the four columns that is available in the excel file comes here from this you have to click and the particular name you want name click insert designation click insert so here you need a comma right you need a comma you will see that afterwards and here you need date so insert Merge field and date. So you select this and adjust your font. Adjust your font with uh, something, some colors. And you just uh, adjust this also. Just choose your seminar color, webinar color to appear in some other color. Okay, and your date, it should also appear in some other color. Since we choose, we just change this color also. Okay. After inserting the name, designation and date, click next write a letter. You are not going to do anything here, just click next preview or letters. Here this is what, this is what your certificate appears. Just click here uh, and to the right you can see an arrow, double arrow. Just click for seeing the second recipient, third recipient and fourth recipient. Everything. The Excel file which consists of four names Anu, Banu, Chandru, Radhi, their names comes here in the certificates like Anu, Banu, Chandru and Radhi. So before clicking the complete the merge, one option that is available is you, you need a comma here, right?
Likewise, the changes. See, the second name also contains comma, third name also contains comma, and fourth name also contains comma. The topic, virtual reality, and the date, it also taken from Excel file. So after the final step is you have to click complete the merge. Next, you have to choose print. And from that, you just to give all the records you needed. So, okay. It will ask by default, Microsoft to print to PDF. You can click OK. Else, you just come on, come to mailings, finish and merge. You can click print documents. Here also, it will ask to uh, choose uh, all the records. So, click all. Microsoft print to PDF. Click OK. Now, you have to give a name. I'm just giving sample certificate demo. Whatever the name you need, you can give. It has been saving, that has been converting into PDF. It has been converted. We can move to the desktop. See, sample certificate demo file is here. Just click on open. The file is opening. So this is what we have designed. A college name, certificate of appreciation. This is to certify that Anu P D comma Dean. The second certificate, Bono. Third certificate, Chandru, and fourth certificate, Pradi. That's all. Our certificate have been generated. Now we can send this to our participants. Remember, we can send a whole bulk certificate to the participants. This is what we are using with the mail merge option that is available in Microsoft Word and the participants list and the other data about them that are available in Excel. We are choosing these two options to generate bulk certificates. Thank you for watching. Stay tuned.